accuracy really does matter and I'm going to give you a few things that I suggest every shooter try to do to become a better more accurate shooter. First off we've all heard of squeezing the trigger and the AccuTrigger what the AccuTrigger allows you to do is to allows you to really have a much more crisp trigger on a firearm and it's an adjustable trigger so you can adjust it to be a little bit heavier or really extremely light and I like mine as light as it'll go that's the way I found that I shoot best. Next off when you go and rest your rifle the way I have it here you'll notice it's resting on the fore end and the reason why it's resting on the fore end rather than the barrel inside this stock is a little channel that the barrel sets in and the barrel is entirely free floating and so if you have it rested on the barrel you're actually affecting the accuracy in a negative way so always rest on the fore end you'll also notice on the fore end I have it rested in front of the sling swivel the reason why is if I put it on the sling swivel like this I can't get a good solid rest and having a good solid rest is absolutely critical to be a good shot I'm going to show you something else that I wind up doing I do what I call follow through. Follow through if you're if you're a, a golfer, you know what I'm talking about. Or an archer, you know what I'm talking about. Follow through is after you pull the trigger. A lot of people will wind up pulling the trigger and then they, they actually anticipate the shot and try to see where they're shooting. And what you want to do is I advise everybody to be able to shoot better. Watch where the bullet hits through the scope. Never take your eye off of the scope. Find your target, and as you fire, I'm going to go ahead and shoot one off here. Find your target, and as you fire, keep your head down. And watch where your bullet hits through the scope. That's called follow through. Follow those tips, and accuracy does matter.